It's drawing comparisons internationally to segregation and apartheid, but the Israeli government defends its new policy as a safety precaution. Israel opened up two new bus lines Monday exclusively for Palestinians traveling from the West Bank into Israel to work. This comes after Israel's government received complaints from citizens that sharing buses with Palestinians posed a security risk. Left-leaning Israeli paper Haaretz had the story first, reporting the new bus lines were advertised only in Arabic to Palestinians. Those who tried to cross into Israel by foot were reportedly turned away. An editorial in Haaretz compared the busing decision to the U.S. Supreme Court case Plessy v. Ferguson. In 1896, the court said separate but equal segregated services were okay, though of course that was later overturned. But speaking to Israel's Ynet News, an unnamed government official says the move was made due to, quote, complaints saying that the buses traveling in the area were overcrowded and rife with tensions between the Jewish and Arab passengers. Though Palestinian paper Al-Quds says the decision didn't really help with that whole overcrowding issue. Instead, the two Palestinian lines weren't enough to handle all the workers traveling into Israel. A poll conducted last fall shows Israelis would actually support further segregation if Israel were to annex the West Bank. 74% said they'd want separate roads for Jews and Palestinians. For Newsy, I'm Zach Toombs. Multiple sources, a broader view.